hello, hello. I'm in my yard and I want you to see what my sunflower is doing. It's growing. I have some dead leaves because I have to really keep it watered. And this is my other one. It's doing pretty good as well. Okay. So I'm going to the back. I bought some bone meal and I am going to repot my fig tree. <laughs> So, Odom told me to get some bone meal and repot it while it's hot. So, that is what I'm going to do. And this is what the garden is looking like. I noticed yesterday I had some more, a couple more ant beds coming up so y'all know I had used the vinegar and salt and a little dish detergent but I am going to try some grits my daughter was telling me that she heard grits were good for the ant in the garden so we'll try that the ant stayed away for a few days but I saw them coming back so I decided I will try the grits this time. Okay, these are my pretty blossoms, okra blossoms. And I have more okra here that I'm gonna come out and cut. As you can see, don't want it to get too big. So I'm coming out and cut some more. Yes, I want to get it while it's small. And I see three or four pods. The collards are growing. I think I'm going to let them get a little larger this time before we harvest. Yes. And let's see, this is a sunflower here, I have two in the garden. There's another one. I have some watermelon growing here as well, as you can see. Mustards right here. And the more I cut the kale, the more it produces. And let's see. You see my purple, my purple peas. I have one on the porch. I'm trying to see if I have any more peas. One of my plants died. It's so hot, everything in these pots just kind of died because of the heat. But this is Jeremiah's zinnia that he planted is doing pretty well. I had to move this particular watermelon because it was dying and I kind of put it over here where the shade comes over here quicker. But I got some watermelons down in there. I got three. You see, I think two of them there. And I have another one in here somewhere. I'm trying to save them. So this plant is looking better. This heat is really something and that is what is happening to the plants. But this fig tree, I am going to repot it because as you can see, this pot is, is too small now. So I have bone meal that I purchased from Lowe's yesterday. So I'm gonna get on that today. And this is another purple 
a royal burgundy. And I see a little one coming here. Some collars here that I'm gonna have to repot and I have peppers. The plant is pretty, but don't see any peppers. And that's another pepper plant there. And this is These are my musters on the porch. So I got all these little white. I don't know if they're moth. I don't know what they are. Little cotton white things flying around in my garden and my plants. So I don't know. I'm gonna move this and put it up here. Y'all see all these little white bugs flying around? This is some more kale. And of course, the eggplant over here. But anyway, once I transplant this fig tree, I will show it to you. Y'all have a great day and thanks for stopping by and making well-intentioned comments. These are some herbs under here. They're doing okay. My microgreens and my Brussels sprouts here and here. My deal is still trying to come up and spearmint here. So it's just been really, really hot. So you all have a great and wonderful day. And I will talk to you soon. It's very hot already. As you can see how hot it is. The sun is bright. It's very hot. So you all stay hydrated. Be safe out here. And I will talk to you soon.